Voldemort and Mr. Peach were like talking about something where Mrs. Peach is trying to like attack Sam, but still trying to look. So she's looking like this, trying to like listen to everything. She's like, ¿Qué? ¿Qué dices? Voldemort is like, no one's even talking to you. Why are you trying to get to our thing? She's like, it's because he's mi esposo, because he's uh, my husband. And then Voldemort is like, are you sure about that? Like trying to like stir the pot, say something. And then he's like, what's that supposed to mean? And where's that boy? Shut up. So they're going through the little thing. And then we hear a knock on the door and everyone's just kind of just sitting there. Doesn't listen to it. Knock on the door. Everyone's just blah, 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 blah. And Alexis, I told you, why did you go and hide it? He's like, yeah, let's hit it. I'm like, no, I did not. Knock on the door. Tomorrow's like, I told her to put it away. Peach is like, why did you tell her to put it away? I told her to put it away. Knock on the door. It's just like, continue to fight. I'm like, okay, I don't even want it. She's like, why do you even want it? Like, I was like, oh yeah, you're right. Cause like, I could never, cause like, I can't, I can't afford expensive things. Oh my God, here we go. Knock on the door. Sam is like, why do you tell her that? You didn't have money until you met my dad. Knock on the door. Mr. Peach is like, everybody, shut up. Up. They're like, why is everyone fighting over this stupid shirt? He tells Mr. Peach, like, what's the reason? Knock on the door. Baltimore is like, answer the f***ing door. And no one gets up to do it. So I was like, oh, <laughs> that's my cue. I go to the door and there is bubbles. Hey beautiful, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, hi, my name is Alexis Jada and welcome. Today's notification shout out goes to Julia. Thank you so much for your love and support. Te quiero mucho. Julia has commented over a hundred times and I am truly grateful for every and each comment i love you so much i had too much coffee today you guys i learned how to make an espresso white mocha at home and tell me why i made two double shot espresso so i had four shots and and then i just found out you can make tea with milk with oat milk and i it's been a lot of sugar today where it's like i need to do the next couple of days no sugar because i feel like i'm like I feel amazing. If you guys want to be part of the notification squad, all you have to do is just like the video, hit subscribe, and leave a comment. And your comment can possibly be the next notification shout out. I do want to give an extra shout out to Jennifer. Thank you so much for your love and support. Jennifer, I love you, girl. If you guys could please give the videos a thumbs up if you guys enjoy story times. It really helps the channel out a lot. And I truly, truly, truly do appreciate it a lot with all my heart. I love you guys all very, very much. All right, you guys. Oh, my nails. Look at my nails. Look at my nails. You guys already know. Nailed by Lily. I got all my baby's names. Oh, the thing's flipped. Got my baby's names on me. Super cute. And this just makes me feel like a little dainty. Like, oh, just, oh, just so cute. Oh, that's so cute. And the shirt. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I need to start saying that more because I feel like I be caring too much sometimes. And I need to be like, I don't care. I don't care. Or just be like... Okay, so these past two shirts, yeah. Alrighty, loves. We left off last week's story time. Let me give you guys a little update of the cheese miss. I probably posted the clip because a lot of you guys liked how I did that and how I set it up. Knock on the door. So for those who are just jumping in, which I don't suggest, go back and watch the previous story time. So it makes more sense. You're more caught up. You're like, eh, okay. But anyways, let me give you guys the gist of it. My mom is incarcerated. Me and my stepdad get into it at the jail. We're fighting with each other because I don't like his tone. I don't like how he walks this earth thinking that he does nothing and he's walking around with clean shoes when they are dirty, okay? Pisses me off. Me and him are getting into it. Me and my mom, we get into it. She's pretty much just wants me just to shut the up don't say anything move it along me and tommy we kind of have like a little like moment we go around trying to look to see for me to beat somebody's ass she was just feeding into it i wasn't gonna really do it she tells me like so what's your plans girl what you gonna do and i'm like oh i don't know just give it to me what are you what is it that you want me to do and she's like oh i'm gonna have my kids so you can't be home for a couple of days and i'm like oh, okay so i reach out to the peaches and ask them if i can stay with them they're like yep you can i go over we are doing a spring clean okay this is insane there is so much stuff so much stuff where i'm just like okay and they want it in a particular order someone close to them is gonna be taking it to mexico we are categorizing everything i get three shirts two pants I like it. There's another shirt I like in particular. I'm like, ooh, I would ask Mrs. Peach, like, hey, can I exchange this shirt for another shirt? She gets livid. There's something about the shirt where she's like, no, 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 no. Nope, nope, nope. It's too expensive for you. You couldn't afford it. Starts going off. It's a whole thing. I pissed her off so much that she goes out, she gets food, comes back, she does not bring me nothing. She tries to say, oh, I didn't know she was here. La, la, la. You knew I was here. She was being rude. She loved to use food as kind of like a, a control thing. Very rude. M Voltimore hides a shirt for me, puts in a bag puts it away sam finds it comes down is like oh you like my shirt she thinks that she's trying to be like cute by saying like oh we can share it mrs peach loses it all, loses it on her because she's like why do you have the shirt so now we know there's something about the shirt 
that is special that she doesn't want nobody to have. Which I'm confused because it's like, bitch, just throw it away then. If you don't want to have it in then throw it away. Does not make sense to me. Anyways, so while everyone's arguing about this, Voltimore is going through the bags and she sees Speedos. She looks at Mr. Peach and she's like, eh? Mrs. Peach gets pissed because valid, that is your husband. So they start bickering, bickering. And while they're bickering, knock on the door, knock on the door, knock on the door. There's a knock on the door. Finally, get to the door, open it, and it's Bubbles and Joe. And that's where we're at right now. We are all caught up right now. All right. So now since we're all caught up, you guys let me know what you guys are doing. If you guys are driving, if you guys are cooking, if you guys are cleaning, if you guys are working, let me know. I would love to know down below. All right, loves. Today, I'm gonna be playing with new makeup as well. I'm so freaking excited, which is so cool too. Yeah, let me know. This is another thing I wanted to know. Let me know right now. When I'm doing story times, do you guys just want me to put on the makeup like I normally do and just leave it down below? Or do you guys want me to kind of talk about it? If I'm like, oh yeah, I'm using this product. I'm, I'm gonna go in with this and then continue to talk. Let me know so I can put out the content that you want to see, all right? If I could do a poll, I'll do a poll, but let me know. Okay, so. <sighs> I should never drink it more, but oh. Makes it so good. It makes it so good. I hate that I love the, the taste of sugar so much. It makes me so happy. Have you ever had such a good of coffee or, or tea and you're just like, I just want to slap somebody's mama. Whew, so good. Okay, sit back, relax, and let's get into it. Let's begin. Super quick. I know I'm a good <laughs> I love the name of this palette. A wildwood. Okay. He's called Fram Bam. I'm shook. Okay. I was not expecting Joe. I was too stunned to speak. And Mrs. Bubbles, I was not expecting to see her, especially how the circumstances last time. So it's kind of more like Mrs. Peach is like, gases, like to let them in. And I'm like, oh yeah, like come, come in. Like I'm just like, why are you here? Why are you here? Even though it's not my house, why are you here? You know, I'm just kind of confused and I feel like I'm just like, okay, I don't know why I got like this. If I could go back in time, I would be like, I don't care. <laughs> because I feel like the look that he gave me was like, oh, okay, okay. Like he was like, all right, yeah. Like he still had like, you know, like he knew he was cute, you know? And he knew he was cute and that's dangerous. I feel like some people can't know that they're cute because they do a little too much and that was Joe. I just go and sit down cause I'm like, okay, this is kind of weird. And I just start touching the clothes and like going through them. They're conversing and talking about, oh, how have you been? What brings you here? I guess Voltimore had invited them over because they have some of their own clothes that they want to send to Mexico. Mrs. Peach looks over at Voltimore, she's like, oh, que bueno, like, oh, that's so nice. You know, and I know inside she's like, bitch. So they see our cute little setup and she's like, oh, this is, oh, that's so nice. Like, oh, like looking at everything, you know, and me and Bubbles, we keep like making eyes like that, you know, just like looking at each other. I feel weird. I don't know how to act. I just feel like <sighs> out of place. I don't know how to explain it. I'm just kind of like shook. Like this is not what I expected. We were all just like whoo, going at each other, a hot fire. And then Bells and Joe walk in and it's just like, I feel like Mojo Jojo right now. You know, I feel like, <sighs> like I just feel on edge. Joe goes, I like that shirt to Sam. Cause you know, Sam's wearing the little thing, you know, she looked look cute. And she's like, oh yeah, you think so? Bubbles is like, where have I seen that shirt before? Where have I seen that shirt before? She just says that casually, you know? Mrs. Peach is like, oh, like she needs to take it off. Like I'm not letting her keep it. I don't know why she has it on. Sam thinks it's funny to be like, yeah, Alexis wanted it, but she didn't want her to have it. Mrs. Peach is like, no, that's no, that's not why. Just tells her that it's too expensive. Sam finishes her thing and Bubbles goes, what's that supposed to mean? She's like, nada, esta loca, esta loca. And Mrs. Bubbles just looks at me. I just look at her cause I'm just kind of like still like, I feel off, I feel weird, you know? She tells Joe, Bubbles tells Joe, hey, go to the car and get the, the backs. Sam says, oh, okay, I'll help you. Mrs. Peach is like, I like to go help. But attitude, I'm like, this is weird. So I'm like, okay. So I get up and Bubbles is like, can we talk after you're done? And I'm like, 
okay? I'm a little sassy, I'm a little like, okay. Like I wanna be like, for what, for what? Because I, I, it, it's a lot of emotions, okay? I feel weird, I just feel like, part of me at times would love Bubble so hard and other times would be like, why can't you just adopt me? Huh, why can't you just adopt me, Mrs. Honey? Like why? I don't understand, like you could adopt me. And so I go outside, so it's me, Sam, and Joe. As we're walking, I have to show you because it's just hard. So this is me, this is Joe, and then Sam's out here walking out cute in front. Joe looks behind and kind of like twinkles his little hands like this. And yeah, I go like that and I'm like, no. I, but like, why did you have to pet him? I don't know, I don't know. But I pet him, I'm like, no, like that. He kind of just like smiles and like bites his lip and then we continue to walk to the car. And in my heart, I'm like, why did you do that? Why did you do that? Why did you do that? And I have to like constantly yell at myself, like, why are you being dumb? Why are you being dumb? I don't know, okay? Ooh, that pigmentation is nice. So I'm thinking it's gonna be like one bag, two bag, three bag, like one bag for each bag. No, there was, there was a lot. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, okay. I don't know why it irritated me. I was just like, the audacity. Like I was just, I was hurt. I don't know why I kept trying to talk to myself like girl calm down and what sucks is when I get in a mood it is so hard for me to fix my face like I feel like my brain doesn't tell my face like hey fake it hey fake it it's like full on puta face like I am just like pito mad you know so I'm just like getting the bags Sam is like trying to show off her ass and that's just what it is because she keeps trying to like move her hips a certain way and like bend down she's trying to show her ass and so I make the comment of like, Sam, we see it. Everyone has seen it, okay? We all have seen it. What are you doing? And she's like, bitch. Like she gets so mad that like I even told her anything cause I'm usually not one to tell her, but I was just so upset for so many reasons. And it was like not even valid where I was going in on her, but I was just upset. Cause I'm like, why are you doing this right now? Like, don't you have a time when you turn down the hoism just a little bit, just a little bit. So I'll brush past her and Joe laughs. Like he thinks that's funny. And so she doesn't like, you think that she Joe. And he's like, well, I'm laughing, aren't I? Sets her off. She's like, okay, okay. Then you have her do X, Y, and Z, da, da, da. And as I'm walking in the front, I'm like, Psh, miss me with that, not even worth it. So she starts getting a little like toot with me. She's like, oh, but the X is not like, yump, 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 like pissing her off. So we walk in, we all have an attitude. We're all talking smack, right? And Bubbles goes, what happened? And I'm like, you have a lot of bags. That's what happened. I don't know what came over me. I know, I don't know what was wrong with me. I got nerve that day and I don't know where it came from. So Voltamaria laughs and says, just say that you need more help. Bubbles goes, well, if it's too much, it's fine. Like you guys don't have to take it all. Voltamore is like, no, 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 está bien, está bien. They send Mr. Peach out to help because he can freaking help. Like, why are you sending us? Because they can, Alex is like, hey, shut up. Mrs. Peach looks at me, kind of brings me closer. Like if she's gonna like, oh, are you okay? You know, so she brings me closer and she's like, you know, like gives me the whole head, are you okay? And I'm like, yeah. So she knows and I know where it's just like, oh, you're gonna turn it up because we have guests. Okay, you're gonna play that, okay. So she's like, in Spanish she said, if you behave, I'll give you the shirt. I was like, I don't want it no more. And so she just looks at me, her eyes get a little bit wide and I swear she was like trying to tell me something in her eye, her eyes are wide. And then she's like, everything, like to go. And so I go and help. As I'm trying to walk out again, I was just like, Alexis, is, is everything okay? So everything like asking me, you know, cause they're used to me being, you know, good, you know? And I'm like, yup. And so I go out. So as I'm walking out, Mr. Peach is coming in. Oh, you are being dramatic, huh? And like, he's like mad. Like these bags are heavy y'all. Like they're heavy, like, and it has like toys. It has like clothes. It has like a bunch of stuff. It has like pots, pants. It's a lot where like, he was like pissed off like coming in with them, right? So I'm walking out and I see that Joe's like standing right there on the sidewalk, just like waiting and Sam is down and getting the bags. And so I just stop in my tracks and he's just like, and I'm like, go Joe. Like I just have like a little attitude and he gets a little startled like, what the? And so he asks me like, are you, are you good? I'm like, yup, yup. I don't know why he thought I want to talk to him. I don't know what he thought. It was weird. So he walks and then I finally walk down cause I'm like, okay, good. Like, I'm not trying to talk with you, converse with you. Like, I'm not trying to do nothing with you. Like, why are you trying to talk to me? So I'm getting the bags, one of the bags rips and I have a little attitude about it. I'm like, oh. okay. So I'm just like picking the stuff up and I walk in with it. Voltimore is like, 
get past someone like get past someone like there's not a basket that I came in with or like what are you doing and I'm like the bag ripped like with attitude and Mrs. Peach looks at me she's like Alexis relax like to uh, relax bitch calm down and I'm like I am Bubbles is like if this is gonna be a problem Peach is like it's not a problem I don't know what's going on all confused part of me was just like acting as like out of her okay other part with me I, I wanted to have mrs peach on her toes i wasn't thinking about consequence later i just wanted to have her on her toes because i really liked how she looked when she was on her toes it was hilarious to me peach is like alexis just sit down and start going through the clothes like i don't know what's going on joe comes back puts some bags down he's like no we could still use your help like come on like i'll help you da, 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 da. and bubbles just looks at me looks at him and kind of just like but it has nothing to do with that maybe so i'm like no i'm good here like i had a little attitude like this is how you all think of me anyways i'm gonna i'm gonna act on it like i'm gonna act like i'm some little bitch i don't even care so i start going through the stuff and there is some nice stuff that bubbles brought like very very nice some stuff even had tags mrs peach says the things that have tags put them to the side bubbles kind of I, like chimes in and she's like oh why is there like a certain thing she's like oh no like it just uh just cuz i'm already thinking like oh you're going to sell this stuff maybe or maybe i don't know something you know bubbles is like oh okay little tomorrow's like do you want to help to bubbles and bubbles like no and she's like oh okay because you have so much to say i just thought maybe you wanted to help and bubbles just looks at her and she's like mm-mm Kind of made me laugh. I was like, okay, a little sassiness coming from both. Cute, cute. Eventually everyone is in the house. We are all trying to help sort things out. It kind of felt like the more that I was being mean to Joe, the more he was like trying to sniff my butt. Okay, that's what I feel like. And I wasn't trying to like do it. Like that wasn't my intention. Like oh, I'm gonna be mean to him. So like he like wants me. No, wasn't the intention. I was just like, dude, I'm like, what are you doing here? Like, why are you here? Even though I know you and, and Sam are like up to no good. Why are you here? Like, and I didn't like that Voldemort always did this. Like she found pleasure out of like pinting us up against each other. And some would be like, oh, it's not that deep. But to me, it felt like it was intentional, you know? So we're going through a lot of this stuff. Some of the stuff, like I said, had tags and some of the items that I'd be pulling out, I'd look at, maybe some things would catch my eye where I'd be like, you know, like, oh, this is really nice. And Bubbles would say, oh, Alexis, if you like it, like, go ahead and like, keep it. Peaches could not help herself. Would chime in and be like, ah, oh, well, like, just wait. Cause like, there's a lot that she already got. Voltimore is like, what? Two shorts, three pants? No, it's not being like, oh, Alex, Alex, have it. And Mrs. Peach is like, well, we're still going through it. And Bubbles is like, well, it's, it's mine. Like she can have it. Peach is like, well, you brought it here. She so would take it. So is it yours? If you want it, you can have it. Is it yours? So awkward. And Bubbles was just like looking at her like, are you for real right now? It was so awkward. And I was like, no, I'm, I'm fine. I don't even want it. Because it's just like, it's fine. It's fine. It's so weird. Like she couldn't help herself. It, I don't understand what it was. She could not help it. Being like that, I don't understand like what it was. The bitch is broken, okay? So we spent a good minute. Bubbles is going to make a run and she asks is like, oh, do you guys want me to bring back anything? Mrs. Peach goes, nope. Baltimore puts in an order and is like, yes, girl, I'll bring this, bring this, bring this. Bubbles is like, okay, I'll be back. Joe wants to stay. Bubbles asks, does anyone want to go? Sam, do you want to go? Sam's like, no. Joe is like, no, mom, I'm good. I'll stay here. She's like, Alexis, do you want to go? I was like, no, I'm fine. She's like, are you sure you don't want to go? I was like, yep, I'm fine. Are you sure? Mrs. Peach is like, she said she's fine. I didn't want to go because I'm just like, I don't, I don't want to get close to Bubbles and then be hurt because I felt like in my child's mind, I was like, you could have saved me, you know? So I was always kind of like, don't get close to her. Don't get close. Don't get close. Don't get close because it's going to hurt. And it did every single time so i was like nope when she leaves mrs peach goes upstairs voltimore takes like a little break and mr peach is off doing something i don't know so it's the three of us left there they keep trying to insert me in conversations and i'm like i'm good i don't want to know about it because i don't i don't want to hear anything i don't want to be like oh yeah huh or well, what do you think don't ask me i don't care i don't care because it was just weird and then how he was like being flirtatious with her and like telling her like oh let me see how this looks on you puts his shirt up against her and he like goes by like this area and then i was like Did didn't your mom wear that and like i would make it weird you know because it was just funny and he'd be like yeah i was like that's weird i forgot i was just so annoyed i was like go home roger 
What are you doing here? Go home. Go home. It was just weird to me. She was out for quite some time. And like, I don't blame her. She was probably just trying to like stay busy. So she didn't have to deal with Baltimore and Mrs. Peach's like snappiness. Like they were just snappy. And it kind of was just like mean girl vibe. And they are really hard to be around at times. I get it. So them being cute together kind of like pissed me off because we would be looking at clothes. I put my hand, he would put his hand on the top of my hand and like it was being flirtatious and Sam was right there. And it just kind of felt like wrong and it kind of just felt like constant toying, toying. And I was just, oh, I was just so annoyed. So everyone's like busy and distracted, right? The adults, we're still going through the clothes, still looking at everything. Sam and Joe are whispering in each other's ears. And you guys, I don't know how to even explain the uncomfortableness. I felt like, oh, like why am I here? Why am I here? Why am I here? I felt so awkward. I felt so infuriated. I felt so mad. I was just like, oh, they end up going towards the back. Sam's like, uh, keep an eye out for us. Yeah. I don't even respond to her. I'm just like, okay, I am for sure. I hate Joe. I hate Joe. Like I hate you. I for sure like hate you, hate you, hate you, hate you, hate you. I was just so mad, like burn book kind of mad. I was so infuriated, but you would, you would have never known. Cause I was like folding the clothes. I gotta give up. Okay, I'm so mad. Everyone is like busy, distracted, so no one has came yet. And the whole time I kept thinking, I hope Baltimore comes, I hope Mrs. Bubbles come, I hope, I hope they get caught. I hope. I was even praying on it. Is that nasty? Yes, but I was, I was like. You know, I was just like, please, someone catch them. Someone, someone please. They are back there for like a good minute. And I don't know if it was like my, my my mind playing tricks on me, but like I could hear a little bit moan. And I was like, okay, okay. And I don't know, you know how sometimes you get so like fidgety, you don't know if you are hearing things or if they really are happening. So you're kind of just like eh, going through this motion. Like clockwork, Bubbles walks in, Voldemort comes down. Bubbles has like food, she has some stuff. So I can see why she was gone. Bubbles, I help her out. I'm not like, too over excitedly helping her out because i was like i don't want to make it too obvious please ask about joe please ask about sam please 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 because i just wanted them to get caught i did is that mean yes is that cock bucking i guess but i was so like wow i was honestly i don't know why i was really hurt that he even had the audacity and los huevos to Take her to the back. Like I was really like, wow, like wifey my ass. Like I was really butt hurt, y'all. After a while, Bubbles looks around and she's like, "Where's Joe?" Voltimore is like, "Where's Sam?" And I was like, "In the back." Voltimore looks at me and she's like, "Doing what?" I was like, "I don't know." Bubbles looks at me and she's like, "No, really, where are they?" I was like, "Yeah, really." Voltimore is like, "Alexis, where are they?" I was like, "In the back." She's like, like mouthing with me like like shook and i was like mm -hmm. bubbles is like how long have they been gone i was like a good minute a good minute to make a baby bubbles is like alexa that's not funny i was like i wasn't trying to be so i'm still going through the clothes and she's like are you okay to me and i'm like yeah i'm fine and i'm just still going through the stuff i don't know why baltimore was so scared to go to the back like i don't know why she was so scared but it's like girl i know i know why you're like that's why you're scared, okay? Mm -hmm. And Bubbles is like, I don't know. I feel like since since I've gotten here, you've just been. I was like, um, shouldn't you be finding Joe? Cause girl, don't talk to me, okay? Don't talk to me. I was so mad. I was just like, uh, you know. And she's like, Alexis, like to me. I was like, yes. I don't, I don't like what's going on here. Okay, you don't have to. I was being so mean. I was just being nasty. But I was just like, um, go find your baby before he makes one go find your baby you know they don't they don't and i'm like what in the hell of it is this like what is going on baltimore's on her phone and she's just like going a mile a minute i know she's texting her get the fuck out here right now I'm like what the fuck are you doing bitch you know mr peach comes down where's everybody bubbles is like that's what i'm trying to find out i was like why are you trying to find it out if i told you she just looks at me and she's like alexis like again like with such confusion and i'm just like what mr peach is like where are they at I was like, atrás, in the back. And he's like, doing what? And I was like, I don't know. Voltimore just looks at me like, what the fuck to me? I, what? And what? He's like, mm. he's the only one that goes and checks, okay? Only 
one. He goes, comes back, and he has Sam. Sam looks a little distressed. She looks a little red in the cheeks. And so supposedly they were just talking. He lost something and they were trying to find it. He, Bubbles is like, where's Joe? She's like, oh, he, he came inside. I was like, I didn't see him come inside. And she's like, yeah, he came in. I was like, no, he didn't. And so I kept like interjecting, interjecting. And Bubbles is like, Alexis, like to me. And I'm like, yes. Say my name, say my name. I think Joe went through the window. That's what I think, allegedly. I think he went through the window. Maybe he did come in and I didn't see him and my head was down because I was like, bitch, you know, that can, I don't know. Or maybe he was just hiding. I don't know. Mr. Peach is like, I don't like playing these stupid games. Just stay in here so I know where, where I know where you're at. Like, what are you doing? Why are you doing all this? Bubbles starts getting on the phone and I know she's calling Joe. I know she's calling him, she's calling him, she's calling him, she's calling him, she's calling him. He walks through the front door. And that's why I was like, I know this motherfucker jumped out the window, okay? He comes in, immediately, mis ojos go to the pito because the fly was open, okay? But that's just me. I'm just that, where well, I'm just, I'm gonna look at everything. And okay, so I, I look at that right away. I already see it where I'm like, okay, you didn't button it up. <sighs> okay. And he has a shirt. He's like fixing his shirt. And he's like trying, he is not good at like trying to like play it off, okay? Not good. His hair looks a little wet. He got like beads right here. And I am so pissed. Cause I'm like, ew, like ew. And you're over here still trying to touch my hand, bitch. Over here trying to talk to me, trying to hit me hard with me, bitch. I was so hurt. I was just like, okay, it's one thing to do it. <sighs> Whatever. I was hot. I was so mad. Do you understand how mad I was? I was so mad. I didn't have any right to be, but I was so mad. Cause I was like, okay, you are this close to getting caught. I was so like, why didn't you guys come down sooner? Like, what were you doing? What were you doing? Like, I was so mad. Like, why didn't you get caught? Because if it was me, I would have gotten caught, right? Right, 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 right? Yes, bitch, I would have gotten caught. So I was so upset. Like, and I, <sighs> so I just look up and I'm like, <laughs> Bubbles is like, I was like, why are you so sweaty? He's like, because I was looking for, I was like, looking for what? He was like, I, I lost my chain. I was like, you didn't come in with the chain. He's like, how do you know? How do you know? And I was like, because you weren't. And he was just looking at me where, like, you know when a dude looks at you? Where like, he you know, looks at you with like, he looks at you like, you know what I'm saying? That's what he was giving me. And I was like, Sam was like, you're weird. Why were you even checking him out? I was like, I wasn't checking him out. I was looking at him. She's like, okay, that's what you, if that's what you think. I was like, okay, Sam. I was like, you're sweating too. I was like, and you stink. <laughs> Baltimore is like, Alexis, do we need to go for a drive? And I'm like, I don't know, do we? I was just on edge, y'all. I was so mad, cause it's like everybody knew what the f they were doing, but no one's gonna get in trouble because you're not me. I was just like, okay, okay. So he goes straight to the restroom, straight to the restroom. And he comes back out and his is up. And I'm like, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. And I just cannot help but just like look at Sam and I'm just like, <laughs> disgusting. Cause I'm so livid. Like, bitch, you are nasty. You are disgusting. How, 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 how? The shirt that she was wearing now looks like it is like wet right here. Okay. If you don't know what that is, I can't tell you. But I look at it and I'm like, she looks at me and she's like, can we go talk upstairs? And I'm like, uh, for what? She's like, can we go talk upstairs? And I said, for what? Because why are you gonna try to raise your voice at me? Like, I am not one where it's like, you think that I'm gonna get timid by you yelling at me. I'm not. If you're an adult, maybe. It's a different kind of thing. But don't get loud with me because I'll take it as a fucking pito contest and I'll whip my out right now and smack it on your forehead, bitch. Don't fucking play with me. So I was so mad because like she got so loud. All the adults are like, Go see what she wants, like to me. And I'm like, so we go upset. Go get you a drink so we can continue. Lexi, where are you? We miss you. <laughs> <laughs> it's my sister's birthday today. She's having a quinceanera. Um, it makes me super emotional about it. I wish I could be there, but due to certain circumstances, um, I can't. Just send good vibes to my sister. It's so cool. She's having a quinceanera. I was giving birth at 15. Gracias a Dios is on a whole different path. 
and actually enjoying her use. You know what I'm saying? I'm so glad. Her, my Andrew, Angelica. Oof. Gracias a Dios. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That was so guerro being pregnant with my mom at the same time. Not once, but twice. Bitch, I needed my own show for sure. I needed my own show. The drama that came with both freaking pregnancies, wild. So I go upstairs and I even have an attitude about going upstairs. Remember I told you guys that Jada came out? It's so hard to put Jada back in because once Jada comes out, I'm like, I think I like this. I think I like this because it be having bitches look at you like, are you okay? Because they're not used to you being like, whoosh, you know what I'm saying? It's so hard to put her ass back. And I feel like I shouldn't put her back sometimes. I feel like she needs to come out and play a lot because a lot of people really just be testing you and just be trying to play in your face like all the time. It sucks that she has to come out for that reason. It's not like, oh, she's coming out to play, have fun, he mini hi. No, she's coming out to protect because y'all like are dumb, you know? So I go upstairs and she closes the door behind us. I'm kind of like trying so hard not to laugh because I know that my little ass is being a little psychotic because I'm like, <laughs> I just want to know like what the f is going on with you? Nothing. And I was like, girl, you better change your tone. Don't be talking to me like that. Like you really got me up. Like, I don't know who you think you is because you got some dick in you. Don't do it. She's like, you see, even that, even that, like what the wrong with you tell her nothing i'm just really tired of everyone like playing in my face like i'm just tired of it you know about me i was like it's one thing me knowing but it's another you doing it in my face okay you had joe over here you do talk to the ex the other boys so you're jealous i was like bitch i am not jealous i'm fed up with how you act how you are call it jealous i don't care dress it however you want i don't give a f i'm tired of it playing in my face is that a threat take it how you want dress it however you will it is what it is and i'm just still standing there and she's just like well you need to stop now i'm so used to sam like coming back with a little like whoosh, but i feel like she was really confused because she was really confused how i was talking how i was behaving and she was like oh my god i'm scared that's what kind of was coming across she's like uh so like did you tell them where we were or like were they just looking for us and i was just like looking at her i was like why sam why it's not like you care it's not like if you have any morals like why do you give a alexis i swear i've never heard so many people call my name so many times are you done sam are you done asking me questions because you're just wasting my time like hurry the up that's what i'm talking about like what is going on i knew that i could have just like you know dialed it down but i didn't want to i was like nope i i'm not doing it i'm not doing it she goes i thought we were good like what's going on like i'm so confused like if this is what's gonna happen between us then like i don't even need him i don't even want him i said no go ahead because i don't even want you so are we done are we done are we done and she was just like dumbfounded she was like i'm just like so confused like i don't even know what I, like i i stole this shirt for you i was like i'm good now like you used it as a comrade i'm good i'm good she's just like what what do i do like like tell i was like you don't gotta do nothing are we done are we done like i was just like shut the up are we done like i didn't want to talk anymore as i'm about to like go for the door she grabs me like really hard and like pulls me back and i was like bitch don't fucking touch me don't touch me she's like i'm just like so confused right now and her eyes are like waltering up she wants to cry and i said bitch like that's crazy that you can do it on command like that's wild i head out i go downstairs and they're all just kind of like quiet and like kind of trying to like what's going on? you know that kind of thing like oh shit, like you were yelling at her pretty loud, you know? I do wanna try these. These are the new Too Faced Melting, Bronzing, and Sculpting Sticks. I got two of them, cause I didn't know what shade I would be. Bubbles was like, oh, I brought you something if you want to go eat. I was like, thank you. I finish up and then I go and sit down to go eat. Who sits next to me? Joe. So Joe sits next to me. There's like, so you could sit everywhere else, but you wanna sit next to me? So he sits next to me and he's like, hey, yo, like, are you good? What's going on? You know? I was like, why are you talking to me, Joe? Like, why are you talking to me? Cause you're wifey. Why the f you keep doing that? So I got mad. So I was like, why do you keep saying that? Like, I was like loud. If he, he's a perro, los pinches like ears go back. He's like, oh, like I was so hot. I was like, why do you keep saying that? Like, what do you think that does? Like, I was so loud. Mr. PJ's like, Alexis, ¿qué pasa? ¿Estás bien? Like, what's going on? 
I was like, yeah, I'm good. He just keeps calling me his wife. And I don't even know why. Because, like, him and Sam were in the back doing stuff. Like, I don't know why he keeps calling me wife. Like, I was having a fucking, like, moment. Okay? And he's like, okay. And Bebbles is like, okay, well, I think it's it's time. It's It's been a long day. It's been a very long day. We're going to get going. Mrs. Peach is like, yeah, I think that's a great idea. Mr. Peach is like, yeah, well, you know, thank you guys. Bebbles is like, I have more bags. If you guys want more bags, Voltamore was like, yeah, you can just leave them by the doorstep. It's time in. Like, whenever you have time, whenever you have time, they leave. Tell me why I like didn't think it through. Like, <laughs> I laugh because like, it's funny. It's traumatizing. But like, I didn't think this through the door closes and i swear like a pack of wolves just three of them like at me and i'm just like remain calm remain calm like you did all this so you better be able to just buckle down and be like deuces bitch go sleep in the park it won't be the first and it won't be the last you'll be all right like if anything you can go crawling back to your ground and be like you know what Psh, whatever you were right it's cool i was at that point of like i don't give a f i don't care i don't care i was at that point like i did not i was just i was just so <sighs> tired of it man i was just so like what the f like, like i don't i just was so they both come all close to me and they're like hey stas bien like are you okay mr peach starts to go in about like that's not acceptable you can't be like acting like that baltimore is like why do you care why do you care you don't even like her why do you care it's the way of like how it makes us look she's like why do you care she keeps going in on him about that and he's just like what do you mean it's the way we it's how we look like she shouldn't be acting like that she's like well she's tired and then she está pasando también. like she has so many bags and she doesn't even organize it correctly da -da 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 -da. And so like they're just like having that like discussion that argument mrs peach is just and mean dogging me the whole time like this bitch wanted to spit in my face it felt like she was just sour mouth her her mouth is so tight it looked like her fucking asshole she was just like like upset with me i had the audacity to say okay which means lit. what bitch just kidding i was like okay. Como que que? like she was so mad that finally like cracked her open and she's like, the way that you acted. And Baltimore's like, she didn't do nothing wrong. What was Sam doing back there? She had no business doing that there. She was organizing this stuff. Like she, and then she's over here trying to see if she wants this and she wants that. She's making her feel. And she was like coming to my defense, even though like the whole clothes thing, that was not even a bad, that, you know, Bubbles was like, oh, do you want it? You know, it was, that wasn't even bad. So surprisingly, Baltimore was like coming to my defense, coming to my defense. And she was like, you guys are going overboard. You guys are over there taking her breaks and you guys expect her to organize it like this, like this. I don't even want to do this shit. so you guys are over here putting this on her telling her to do it like this and then you forgot her food so of course she's still gonna be upset about it like what the fuck is wrong with you so baltimore was having my back about it and like mrs peach is like what <laughs> so, I, 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 get, get nada, hand. like you over to you know doing this and doing that da, 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 da. and then mr peach is like who even called bubbles who called bubbles uh-huh okay so shut up like to her and she's like that's besides the point like you know they have good stuff like me you know like all the tags that it has and stuff da -da 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 -da. like it's good stuff it's good stuff it was a whole thing so at the end of the day they're just like shut the fuck up and let's just move on like stop talking about it right but sam she wanted sangre she was pissed she was mad which i don't give up bitch i don't care miss me with that you got me fucked up like i don't care i don't I'm, oh that really does go with me huh I don't care, cause I did not. I did not. Cash me outside, how about it? So I could feel Sam hunting for me. I could feel it. Her little attitude, her little like snarky remarks, I could feel it, but I didn't care. I was like, dude, this ass whooping has been brewing for a long time. She's been crazy for a reason, for a good minute. I don't care when, what, where, I don't care. Okay, so we were still going through bags. You would think that like, oh, spring cleaning is only a little bit of things for them. No, it was like a lot. It was a lot. So maybe that too is why I was so like upset is because, it, because, because it was a lot of stuff and they were so, you know, like, oh no, this one because of this. Nope, no, nope, no, nope, because this one because of that. And now we have bubbles and stuff. And that was a lot of expensive things too. And there was a pile that they want me to put certain things at. I knew it was because they were going to keep it for themselves because it was really nice stuff but i know it's because like they wanted to keep it i'm not dumb i'm not gonna sit there and be like oh for you i just know how to read the room if i want to be a little shit, 
then yeah, I guess I can say something, but like I just, I knew what it was. I had a pile for Baltimore and I had a pile for Mrs. Peach. What pants fit her, what pants didn't. I was a little annoyed how they were like making their comments of like, look at this and look at that. Like she's so dumb. Like she doesn't know how to dress herself. Like shut the f up. Like half of the sh that I'm looking in here is like way nicer than the y'all have like y'all swear like y'all really swear and bubbles brought some makeup and some of it still had like a clearance tag on it and stuff and they're all like ah mira mira like no tiene vergüenza like she's not embarrassed and it's like for what like why the f is she be embarrassed for y'all should be embarrassed for judging like that the f is wrong with y'all who can raise you you bitch mrs peach is like then Get a suna. I was like, oh no, I stop being like, I'm, I'm okay. I don't really like lip gloss as much. I just said it just to say it. I didn't know, I didn't really have like a reason. I just didn't want anything and I didn't want to sit there and have to like argue with her. I just didn't want it, all right? So I was like, no, I'm sorry. Oh, you're too good for it? You're too good for it? And I just kind of laugh and I'm like, it's only $2. Like, no, I'm like, what? She's like, don't act like this isn't the stuff that you buy. So I was like, okay. That's not funny. And she's like, I wasn't being funny. Okay. Mr. Peach is like, get the It's like to her, like, what is wrong with you? Like, why do you do that? She's like, I'm not doing anything. She has a mouth on her. You know that this is probably stuff that she wears. Like it's in her budget. She's like, oh, I'm gonna get like, what budget? My mom can't even afford to keep me. He's like, yeah. She's like, no, it's the truth. Like can't even afford to keep me that I don't even have anything nice that the only thing that they have nice is the things that they give me and i was like well so quieres like just take them back like i don't want it especially if you're gonna be using it like that in my face and she's like i'm not throwing it in your face i'm telling you what's true that your mom can't even take care of you that strangers have to take care of you he gets upset he stands up and he's like ja like to her she just walks away with a smirk on her face and i'm like okay all righty cool that's cute i don't know what the was i don't know if it's because like i did throw my little fit with her earlier and so she's just like trying to jab at me it's just like dumb it's like you think you're so cool picking on a kid like you get like a kick out of that you weak bitch okay i was like all right and it sucks that she was such a bully because the kids got bullied so hard in school it just sucks because if the karma doesn't come to you it comes to your children and it just sucks because she didn't understand that she literally just thought like why don't they like you we have this we have that we have this and it's like because of that because of how you speak how you talk how you present yourself to la gente like you're just nasty dude like you really are just gross that looks like it just blended in like ma shit he's gonna no he didn't call it i'm cold i want to eat all my pants or shoes i got sent this and i want to try it out a fruity treat for your lips and cheeks you guys already know i'm going for this one which is the peach cobbler so they sent me two so i will be doing a giveaway with one of them which i thought was so nice oh look at that oh 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 Bring it back. Bring it back now, y'all. Oh, that smells, that smells good, you guys. Gorgeous. And then stayed on the brush. So I go upstairs because that's where I'm gonna chill. I'm gonna chill upstairs in the room. So I get a message and it's from Joe. And he's like, hey, can we talk about how you acted? And I was like, nope. I didn't act any which way. Don't talk to me. And he's like, I miss my old wife. Like, why are you acting? I don't know who gave him this book of fuck. Don't. Talk to me like that, stop. Like he really thought he was doing something but he was just aggravating the demon in me, like for real, for real. I'm sorry, Alexis can't come to the phone right now. Vibes, he keeps trying to like talk to me, like, hey, can we talk? We didn't even do nothing, we were just talking. I was like, did you not see that I saw that your fly was down? Like, what are you talking about? Like, I don't wanna do this back and forth. Like, it don't even matter. Like, I don't even know why you think like I care, like I don't care. That's just how I am now, that's the new me. And he was like, well, you, the new you's a bitch. I was like, yeah, now me and you are twins. Twinning! He gets upset and he's like, don't be calling me a bitch. And I said, oh, what? I don't wanna have to show you. I took it as like, oh, okay, so you think that you're going to do something. He was taking it as a foreplay. No, I don't, no, no. We continue to go into it, go back and forth. And Sam comes in the room, snatches my phone out of my hand. I don't know who the f is this bitch, but she really was on my nerves. So she snatches the phone out of my hand and i get pissed i don't think at all i don't know why y'all know why jada's out she snatches it and i just boom, push her push her with all my might and she's like the phone goes flying i don't even check on her i don't even look at her i don't see the damage that i, I caused none of it and i grab my phone i was like don't be touching my shit. and i go and sit on the bed she's like get the off my bed i was like bitch make me like i was so mad so we're like yelling at each other breath, 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 breath. i was like get the out of my face your breast was like dick bitch she's like yeah and you're jealous you're jealous i was like what uses you like a garbage disposal like no bitch 
I'm good. I'm good. We're going back and forth, back and forth. You're just jealous that he likes me. I was like, no, I'm not. Cause he's still calling me wifey. I don't want him. I don't need him. He messes with you because he, you do something that I won't do with him. Because after you're done pleasing him, he comes back and he keeps bugging me. She's like, I don't believe you. And so I show her the phone. I'm like, look, Nope, I don't believe you. I was like, nope, look. And she's like, I don't wanna look at it. I was like, yeah, cause you're delusional bitch. I go back to where I was sitting and she's just sitting there, like just sitting there. And she's like, who texts who first? Who texts who first? And I was like, bitch, stop clapping. Cause I didn't even say nothing funny yet. Stop. Like I was so irked and she just kept like, no, like tell me right now. Like tell me right now. I was like, Sam, shut the fuck up. Cause you're still gonna be there taking them shots. So shut the fuck up. And I continue to text him. It's like, okay, you miss old wife, then do something that you would do for old wife. Just to stir it. This is for Alexa Jada. Isn't that cool, y'all? Isn't that cool? Alexa Jada introducing the Laura Mercier's new translucent pressed powder. Her little psycho ass tries to sit next to me and talk to me calmly. And she's like, I just, I just want to talk. Can you show me him messaging you? I'm like, Sam, get away from me. Like right now, get away from me. And she's trying so hard to con like control herself. You can see it. Does it look, oh, it does look blurred. Look at this side compared to this side. So she's like, I just, I just, I just want to talk. Okay. Like, I don't want to say like mean things to each other because like sometimes the things that you say, like they cut really, really deep and like they f me at night. Like I stay up up late at night and I just like, I'm thinking about it. And I'm like, is it true? Is it not true? I was like, I'll tell you right now. It's true like that's how i feel about you like point period blank bitch like that's how the i feel about you she's like i don't know what's wrong and why you're acting like this like i said she was talking to me and i was just like sam get the f out of my face like get the f out of my face why are you laughing at me like this is not funny like she was like having her moment and i was like okay let me done let me know when you're done having that little moment because you're irritating me like you really are irritating me she was trying so hard to like control herself i felt bad i'm not gonna lie i felt bad because i was like damn jade like just just stop you and joe are never gonna be anything like it's why you like why do you care i was just so hurt that like i didn't know how to just stop and I didn't want to stop because I feel like if I let up, she was going to go back yet again, yet again. So she's doing all that, okay? Like, <laughs> like that. And I'm just like, <sighs> I was like, Sam, you're really disgusting me right now. And she's like, because <gasps> I'm crying. I'm like, yeah, because you're crying. Like go somewhere, go do something, like go over there. She's like, do you know I could have my dad kick you out? Like, do you know? I was like, there it is. There it is, like there you are. I was waiting for when you were gonna come. She's like, stop talking like that, you sound crazy. I was like, okay, are you done? Like, stop talking to me, stop talking to me, stop talking to me. And then she like just blurts out, I'ma get stitched to beat that ass. And have her beat it, bitch, and have her beat it up. I don't give a fuck. Okay, bye, are you done? Are you done? Okay, I'll stop, okay, I'll stop, just just show me. And so I showed her the message where he was like, I miss my old wife, whatever. And she's like, he doesn't even call me that, like, I don't, I don't understand. Like, I don't understand. And I was like, yeah, because that's all he uses you for is to take them shots. Yeah, like, yeah, you're just for entertainment purposes only. And I'm not over here thinking like, oh yeah, like I'm getting her, I'm getting her. Like, I'm just like, yeah, the bitch is speechless. I don't know why I was over here like acting like jump, jump. Like if she couldn't hurt me back, like, I don't know why. I was just like full Jada mode did not care since i told joe do something for me he's like writing me long ass messages about what he likes about me what he wanted to do that when he was with sam he was just visualizing me which is gross like i don't know if you thought you did something with that that's gross because that's disgusting and he wishes it was me he's jealous of the ex because the ex gets to actually feel the warmth of me which is ew that's gross. And he just keeps like saying all these things. And I'm like, more, more, more. And he's like, is this like doing something for you? I was like, oh yeah, it's doing something for me. And this whole time I'm like this to Sam. And she's just like looking at me and she's like, what did I do to you? Blah, 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 blah. I was just so mean. Cause like, I could not stop. I could not stop. I don't know why. Like, I was so, I don't even know. I don't even know. She tries to be like, she tries to like hurt my feelings. She's like, can I show you something? I already knew what it was going to be, okay? I already knew 
but I was like, go ahead, Sam. She shows me old boys nudes. Okay, you don't care? I was like, I don't. I know you care. I was like, I don't. I know you do. No, like you think you're doing something, but you're not. She's like, I know you care. I was like, I don't. It hurt. I was like, what the f What in the f***ery? So she thinks I'm I'm talking to Joe, but I'm texting X, and I'm like, you're f disgusting. You're a f dog. Like, don't ever f speak my name again. You f worthless piece of sh. Like I was going off on him, and he's like, what are you complaining about now? What did I do now? And I'm like telling him that I I saw his pito out, and that what the f you over here embarrassing me and sh blah, blah 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 blah. He's like, again, what are you talking about? I know that he texts her because she starts laughing. <laughs> I thought you didn't care. I thought you didn't care. I was like, I don't. I'm just breaking it off. Like, I don't care. That's why I'm breaking it off. Are you stupid? And she's like, just quiet. Just quiet. And during this, Joe is still going. Paragraph after paragraph after paragraph. Talking about my lips and this and that. My hair. My neck. My back. No, 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 no. I was like, yeah, but if you really liked me, like you wouldn't have done this. He's like, it was her idea, blah, blah, blah. I was like, doesn't mean you gotta go through with it. And still, I'm like showing her like, mm -hmm. tell you, tell you. I just thought midway because I don't know what it was. I don't know if it was like my conscience. Are you my conscience? But I felt nasty. And that's when I know Jada's getting put back because I start feeling like gross. Like I need to go shower. I'm like, ooh, this isn't cute. Like, I don't like this. I just tell her, I was like, okay, I'm done. <sighs> go to the restroom, I take a shower and I'm like, I am so sorry. Like, why the f did you do that? Like, I'm talking to myself like, oh my God, you're crazy. Like, why did you do that? Like, that was gross. That's nasty. We don't want to act like that. That's gross. So I come out, Sam is crying. And I'm like, why are you crying? You don't care, you don't care. And I'm like, okay, I don't, don't tell me. She's like, oh, my dad just like took away my phone. And she's like crying. So I guess he came in and like they scolded her when I was busy so that they didn't do it in front of me, which is like, okay, whatever, cool. You can do whatever you want. That's your kid. That's your baby, which is cool. Whatever, do your thing. So they scolded her and they're like really grossed out. Like, why did you do that? I'm like, Sam, you're going to be fine. Like, you're good. Like, stop. No, because I was talking to Joe and they were going through my messages, yada, 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 yada. And I was like, oh my God, breaking down. She's so sad, blah, 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 blah. She asked us if she could use my phone. I'm like, I'm not going to let you use my phone. Like, are you dumb? Like, no, I'm not gonna let you use my phone. She's like, please, like, I just got, I just wanna say goodnight. Like, that, like, I just, I just need to tell him goodnight. Like, oh, I, you don't know like what he has. Blah, 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 blah. Like, there's something about him. And I was like, oh my God. Your bruja too. Oh my gosh. Okay. So I let her use the phone. She calls him private. She tells him what happened. And he's like, it's okay, babe. Like, it's fine. And I'm just like, ew. Like, that's so gross. You're here over here telling me all these things. And it just makes me so mad. Because it just makes me think of, like, all men are the same. The ex is, like, no different than this guy. No different. Calling her babe and like, I love you, don't cry. Like, tell me that, tell me this, tell me that. Telling her like to say things and she's saying them on command. And I'm just like, gross. And I'm just like looking at her and she's just like, you know, sad. They're being like super gross, nasty with each other talking. And I'm just like looking at her, shaking my head because we are both so dumb. We are both so dumb. Like, how can we be so dumb? Ugh. So he tells her like, you think you can sneak out? Like, come on, like, if you really love me, like literally the same sh that the ex would tell me, he's doing to her. So I'm over here thinking I'm being Captain save -a and I'm like, Sam, he's playing you. Like, I'm literally showing you. She's like, Alexa, shut up. I'm like, you know what, I will, because like, I am the same. Like, I don't know what it is. I think it's because like, we didn't have any like good examples in our life that like, we're just like, pendejas, you know? So he's like telling her like, if you really love me, Sam, like prove to me, like prove to me. He didn't get to like finish what they were doing and stuff like that. And I'm just like, how nasty, how gross. But again, I can't say anything because it's literally verbatim what they are saying towards each other. And I'm just like, how gross, how gross. So he's literally telling like super things that he wants to do to her, yada, yada, yada. Sam has it on speaker, not loud enough so like everyone can hear, but like loud enough where like I can hear. And so I was like, okay, give me my phone back. Like I want my phone back, like give me back my phone. And she's like, okay, 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 okay. Like I'll see what I can do. Like talk it to him, right? Tell me why this mother is me minutes later and says, everything I said to her is what I really want to do to you. And I'm just like, you are a 
dog. I was like, I literally hate you. You literally disgust me. And he goes, you don't mean that, babe. So gross, so gross where I'm like, what the f what happened? Is your dad not home? Did your daddy leave your mommy? Like what is going on with you? So totally grossed out. Okay, Sam ends up sneaking out. She doesn't get caught, comes back. She's all smiles, all giggly. He's like, <laughs> he gave her a phone. He gave her a phone. Cause these people are rich. Gives her a phone is like, you can use that. Make sure it's on silent. You can hit me up. Call me, reach me, when you wanna beat me? Na, 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 na. The whole time that she was out, I was just so disgusted. And so like, I wanted to like go downstairs and be like, knock on the door to f Mr. Peach and Mrs. Peach because I was so mad. I was so mad. Is it celos? I don't know. It was just, I was disgusted where I was just like, <gasps> I'm literally seeing myself and I can't do nothing to like stop it, prevent it, nah, yeah. Two days, we are literally going through the freaking bags again. She keeps going to the restroom because she's messaging him, she's texting him, she's like getting in the groove. She's like, oh my God. They're like, if you act right, maybe I'll give you your phone back. She's like, keep it. And I'm just like looking at her cause like, bitch, you're dumb. They're gonna catch on, you're dumb. Like you are, you're dumb. Like you are so dumb. We finally get finished of going through all the clothes. I now have like a bag that had holes or it had a stain or it was too ugly that I could have, I could wear. It's like, there you go, this is, that's yours. I was so excited about it. Okay, cool, fine and dandy. So I asked like, can I throw a load in? Mr. Peach is like, yeah, go ahead. They're like, no problem. As I'm throwing stuff in the load, I noticed that my black dress is not in there. Remember Mrs. Peach gave me a black dress? It's not in there. So I'm like, mm, like where the hell is the black dress? So I'm like going through it, I don't see it. I come out as ask Voltimore, I'm like, hey, have you seen the, the dress? She's like, no, it should be in there. Mrs. Peach is like, it should be in there, Alexis, and find it right now. So she starts getting mad where she's like, you better find that because that's expensive and I just gave it to you, like, what the f Mr. Peach is like, Alexis, find it. So I'm like, okay, so I go through all of the bags again because I'm like, I don't want to go and start accusing people of where it could be, yada, yada, yada. And Voltimore already had asked Sam, like, hey, do you have it? And she was like, no, I don't. So I went through every single bag and the whole time I'm going through these bags, these three mother are like, find it. No, like find it. And I'm like stressing. I'm like, I'm looking for it. It's not like if I go anywhere, it's not like if I sneak out, like I was just, you know, being low. it's not like if I do anything. And then Mrs. Peach is like, and that's not by choice, like trying to be funny. And I'm still like trying to like look through everything. She's like, mm. people like you, like you probably did something with it. You probably gave it to somebody. I'm like, I don't go anywhere. I don't go anywhere. Like, what are you talking about? I don't go anywhere. So I'm going through everything. I can't find it. I can't find it. I can't find it. And so I go upstairs. Sam's upstairs and she like has the cold. We had the blanket over her and she's like, you know, texting, doing that kind of stuff. I'm like going through her closet. So I'm like, it has to be in here. As soon as I open it, go through it. She finally takes the cold hat over and she's like, don't go through my shit. Touch my Shit. I'm like, bitch, shut the f up. Like, I know you probably took it because that shirt you used as the cum rag, it was in there with the f dress. So, like, where the f is it? I don't have it. I don't have it. And that shit look good on you, anyways. She was just being rude. So, I'm like, going through it. I don't care. I'm looking for it. I don't, at this point, I want her to put her hands on me so that we can scuffle. Like, I want it to happen because it's just like, you are making me mad. Like, you are pissing me off. So, I'm going through everything. I can't find it. And I'm like going through everything. Baltimore comes in and she's like, Where is it? Where is it? And I'm like, I don't know. She looks at Sam and Sam's like, I don't know where it's at. I don't have it. I don't have We're literally going through everything because at this point, they're like, We need to find it. They don't know where it could be. Can't find it. And I'm just kind of like sad because I can't find it during this whole time. Mr. Peach is now putting the bags like in this like big ass like kind of van looking trailer thing and just like stuffing all the bags. Other friends have came too, but we didn't go through the stuff like just in there. Toys, it's getting stuffed. Everything is getting stuffed in there. So I come downstairs. I had clothes in the washer. Now, since I was like looking for everything, I put them in the dryer. So we're continuing, we're continuing looking and they're like, oh, is you better find it. No ifs or buts, you better find it or else. And I'm like, okay, like I will. So I'm like looking, I'm looking and I go up to Sam. I'm like, Sam, just wonder where you, where, like, where you put it. Like, let me, tell me right now before I tell them that you snuck out and you did it. She's like, you got no proof of it. So I'm like just getting so flustered and I'm like so annoyed. Tommy messages me. Hey, I'm gonna pick you up. I'll take you back. I need to talk to you. It's about your mom. I'm like, okay. So I'm serious, Thomas is Peach. I'm not asking. 
permission. I'm like, hey, my aunt's gonna come pick me up. I have to leave. It's something about my mom. I'll be back. Get them on that. Like, who's in charge of you? You know, and I'm like, I have to go. I'll be back. Mr. Peach is like, it's fine. Yeah, vite, vite, vite. Well, tomorrow is like, hopefully while you're out, you find that dress. Cause now all of a sudden you have to leave. All of a sudden, I was like, yep, all of a sudden. So then Tommy picks me up. Me and Tommy go out, me and her are talking. She's telling me that my mom's gonna be getting out, but that my mom pretty much wants to work things out with my stepdad. I already knew the whole conversation was coming. I was like, okay, whatever. At this point, I was already getting in that mindset of like, I'm not gonna be home. Like, I'm not. I'm either gonna be out in the calle, I'm gonna be at the exes, I'm gonna be with the peaches, I am gonna be with my grandma, but I'm not gonna go, I'm not gonna go home. My mom pretty much has let me know, like, hey, you're not priority, your brothers are. My mom would always tell me, like, you're just, you're just different you're more mature you know dress it up that way of like oh you got this you got this no mom i was still a baby i didn't have all i had was me myself and i and it should have been you me and grandma and my brothers that's what it should have been but it wasn't like that pretty much she's trying to like lay it on and like you know like well you like you let me know you let me know what you want like what 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 choices do i have tommy i either have my grandma i have the ex or i have the peaches like what choice other do i have like none of i want it to be my mom like i want it to be my mom she's telling me that like i need to think about my brothers everyone's always saying that i need to think about my brothers and i think that's why if me now in adulthood every older sibling probably feels this or you know but it's not like it's not i think it's just like where this has been and it's like brainwashing is so real like it really is i feel like i tend to think about my siblings a little bit too much even in as even though they're starting their own families they were adults all that i'm still like i still can't move forward and do x y and z unless they are part of that x y and z even though they don't want to be part of that X, Y, and Z, they're just like, you got to stay here because we're staying here. You know what I mean? Like moving. I've never moved because I'm like, I can't be away from my brothers. Like I love them so much. And I do. Those, they are my babies. Maybe that's what started it. That's what started, started the domino effect. But anyways, so she's pretty much telling me that. I'm like, Tommy, you couldn't tell me this in text message. You like literally had to pull me out. Like now it looks like I'm guilty of something that I'm not. She's like, what are you talking about? So I started telling her about the dress thing and she was like, oh my God, like they'll be fine. Like they're just bored. So they're just hyper fixating on it. Like it'll be all right. Like you'll be good. And I'm like, nah, like this dress was cute. Like I don't know where it is. She's like, you already know who has it. I'm like, I know, but I don't know where she put it. So we're just like talking about it. And she's like, I wanna make sure that you're fed and then you know, you got something good to eat. So we went to Beto's, we're eating. Tell me if I need any shampoo, if I need any like deodorant, if I need any, anything at all. So I was like, oh yeah, like I need deodorant and I need shampoo. She's like, okay, cool. So we get that stuff. She drops me off. Hi, bye. She don't even ask me like, hey, you wanna come back? Like it like slowly happened and I knew it was happening. Like I knew this was like her like goodbye because it just, I just knew it, you know? I just knew it. I was like, okay. Cause like her kids weren't even with her. Her kids were not home. So it was just like, this was like her goodbye and was just like, here, like stay with them. You know what I'm saying? So I get back inside. It's still like running around, talking, cleaning, all that. They're like, oh, help us with this. I help them with that. Check on my clothes. And they just kind of get quiet. And I already felt like the music was starting to get done I already felt it coming. Felt like it was coming. I felt it. And I was like, I knew it. Like I knew it. Like I called it. I called it from the get. I feel like I talked to myself so much in my head that I give myself so many different scenarios of like this, this, coulda, shoulda, woulda. So many different things so that when something does happen, I'm like, I know it. Cause I already got like 50 things of like, this could have happened, like 50. And I'm like, why did you do it? So I go, there's nothing in the washer. There's nothing in the dryer. And I'm like, Okay, I already feel it in my gut of like, you lost the dress, so now you don't get the, now you don't get the clothes. Like, you don't get nothing now. Because you showed them that you couldn't take care, care of something, so now they're like, now you don't get nothing. That's what it is, that's what it is. So I'm already like talking to myself, you'll be all right, take it on the chin, you'll be cool. Wasn't yours anyways. It wasn't yours anyways. It was just something that you're gifted, and it wasn't yours Anyways, unless you bought it with your own money, it's not yours. It's not yours. It was gifted to you and they could take it back. It was gifted to you, you could take it back. I, I calmly collect myself, walk out there. Mrs. Peach is like, okay, like annoyed. I was like, nah, okay. And that right there, everything was said. Everything was said. Everything right there, that's everything was said right there. So I was like, okay, cool. I hurt for little Lex because it just pisses me off how that was their tough love. And like when we would argue about it, that was their way of showing me that like, we would have did it to our own. Like you're part of it. That's what we did to you too. And we're not gonna treat you any different. And it's just, it's very like a mind Cause it's like, no, no, you wouldn't have. And that, that's nasty to play with the kids emotions like that. Like, that's nasty. I help clean up and the whole time Mrs. Peach is like just antagonizing me. I'm like, okay, okay, 
¿Qué quieres decir? Like, what, what, what do you want to say? And I'm like, dude, like, she's just on me, like, on me. She just, like, wants to say something. Like, she just wants me to be like, why did you do it? Like, she wants me to feed into it. I'm like, I'm not. Like, I know you're hungry. Go have someone else feed you, bitch. Go feed on somebody else. Because it's not working. It's not working. It's not working. So I clean up, finish up. I hear her saying, like, yeah. like, And then she's over here with attitude. Like, you know, this is why it's so hard. And I'm like, who the f is she talking about? Me, she's talking about me, she's talking about me. And Mr. Peach is like, she doesn't have an attitude, nothing, an attitude. Like she took it a lot better than what I expected, blah, 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 blah. Tell Mr. Peach, good night. And he was like, good night, mija. And that's what messed with me, is when they would like say like, mija or amor, or you know, th those kind of, it just messed with me. Cause it's just like, this is so confusing because it confused the hell out of little Lex because like I'm hurt. But then he said mija and I was like, oh, like he cares. So confusing, right? So confusing. So I go upstairs, I'm about to knock out with Sam. So how do you feel? I was like, about what? He's like, cause now you don't got How do you feel? I was like, Sam, I'm good. I was like, I don't give a It's just close. To me, that doesn't matter to me. Like, it's cool. It's good. I don't give She's like, good. Cause you couldn't afford any of that anyways. Okay, Sam, cool. She's like, I know you're mad. I know you're mad. Like she trying to poke, trying to poke. And I was like, yeah, that's okay. Joe would cheer me up. And I just turn around and I could just, oh, you know how you just get like ansias, like, oh, you just feel like, okay, the bitch is gonna attack me from the back. Like, oh, turn back around. But I didn't want to turn back around cause I was so scared. Like I was so scared the bitch was gonna kick me in my face. Like so scared, pass out. Okay, I pass out, I'll go to sleep. Middle of the night, Sam leaves. Okay, she's sneaking out again. She's doing what she's doing. I can see her in my peripheral. I don't want to move completely because I was like, if she knows that I'm up, maybe she won't go. Like, I'm going to get this bitch caught. Like, I am going to get her caught up. Like, I just am. I'm just like laying there waiting for her to leave. She leaves. I'm gonna like make noise. I'm gonna do something. She has her bed look like she's like sleeping in it, right? I'm like looking at it. I'm like uncovering it. So like, as like I'm uncovering like her bed, I see like something like in the corner and like right away, I'm like, there's no way. Like there's just no way. There's like no way. She hit my dress like in the corner of like the bed. So it's like this and like the black dress is right there. And I'm like, que fea, que fea. But good on you, bitch. No, that was good. That was good. Like I was hurting ya. That was good. That was good. It hurt my feelings. So I kind of pull it out a little bit more and kind of like stuff it underneath her pillow. I kind of make like the blanket that she had over like a little bit more flatter. So it's like, it had like a lot of cushion like this. So like you would think someone was sleeping underneath it. I just moved it. So like, it looks super fake. Like, no. I go to the restroom. I slam the door, flush the toilet. I make a lot of noise and I'm like, oh, I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Cause I know, I know it's about to go down. I'm like, okay, it's cool. But I still have that little mentality of like I don't give a f and then I felt like Jada was trying to tiptoe back out because the dress bitch the dress the dress the dress I was so mad because like I knew she had it I knew she had it and it pissed me off because I lost the whole bag of clothes and it pissed me off Mr. Peach comes through the door like super psychotic like he like opens the door like all, all psychotic and I was really expecting Mrs. Peach because like Mr. Peach had him been sleeping there like all the nights you know so I was just like like quiet, but I knew it was him because he was like, ¿Qué estás, qué estás haciendo? like, what are you doing? And I'm just sitting there like acting like I'm just like, Shh. you know how hard it is to like pretend. And he was like, Alexis, I know you're not sleeping, but I had to like buckle down. I was biting the sh out of my tongue. I was biting my tongue and I was so scared that was gonna come off. I think I have left like permanent like bite marks on my tongue. I'm like biting it, I'm biting it, I'm biting it. And I'm like trying so hard not to laugh because like I'm scared. Has anyone giggled when they're like about to get their ass beat? Yeah, I don't know what's wrong with me. So I'm like biting my tongue and he's like, Alexis, I know you're not sleeping. And I'm like, <sighs> like I'm all of a sudden you snore bitch, okay. And I'm like just really trying to like, okay. So he comes over and he like shakes me, like shakes me really I'm like, oh, 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 okay, what's happening? Like, I try to play it off. He's like, I know you're not sleeping. And I was like, I was. I'm like, really trying to buckle down. He's like, where's Sam? I was like, I don't know. I don't know. He's like, yes, you do. Where's Sam? And I'm like, do you know what I'm I don't know. I don't know. Mrs. Peach comes in and she's like with her robe, like, what's going on? And she's like looking over. And then the first thing she notices is the dress. So she grabs the dress and she's like, wow walks out Mr. Peach is like where's Sam and she's like how am I supposed to know where's Sam like you just came you got the fucking thing like that doesn't even matter where's Sam and she's like I don't know so he starts grilling me he's like where's Sam I'm like I don't know I don't know tell me why this 
guy instead of like telling me like hey call this person call that person this psycho had the lights turned off in her room and he laid down in her bed he laid down in her bed sam didn't come home for the next few hours okay bitch was gone bitch was like playing full on house okay she sneaks back in and all i heard was <laughs> and i'm gonna end it there you guys i love you guys so freaking much Miss is at the list. I hope you guys enjoy story time. If you guys enjoy story times, please make sure to give me a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already to keep up doing my videos. And I'll see you guys in my next story time. Bye! I love you guys. Keep, 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 keep.